Hey everybody, welcome back for another adventure and an amazing story from the Bible. Aubra, what did you think about the cool challenge activities from last week? I really enjoyed creating the contraption that drops the baking soda into the cup of colored vinegar and creating a fizzy rainbow. Yes, and that rainbow reminds us that God keeps his promises, like the promise he made to Noah that he would not flood the earth again. Aubra, question for you. What did Noah say when he finished loading all of the animals onto the ark? Now I've heard everything. <laughs> well, today we are going to learn about another important man in the Old Testament from the book of Exodus. Through Moses, God freed his people from slavery, guided them through a, a desert, and gave them and us directions to our daily lives. Yes, and those directions are called the Ten Commandments. It's the law that God gave to his people through Moses. And so our take-home point for this week is, repeat after me, Rainforest Explorers! Rainforest Explorers! My loving God gives me directions. My loving God gives me directions. Jesus leads the way. Jesus leads the way. <clears throat> I'm really excited to learn about Moses' story and what directions God gives us in the Ten Commandments. But what if I make a mistake and don't follow the commandments? Will God be mad at me? Well, that's the thing, Aubra. While God gave us these commandments uh, to us as directions on, on how to, to love Him and love each other, we, we don't always follow them like we should. And that's called sin. Fortunately for us, Jesus loves us so much that He paid the price for our sins on the cross. And through Jesus, we are forgiven. In our memory verse for this week, God lets us know that we are special to Him also. God says in Exodus 19, verse 5, You shall be my treasured possession. Wow, we are so lucky. Will you pray with me in thanking God for these gifts? Sure. Dear God. Dear God. You promised to lead the way. You promised to lead the way. You will love us and give us direction. You love us and give us direction. Forgive us when we don't lo love you. Forgive us when we don't love you. Or others. Or others. Thank you for Jesus. Thank you for Jesus. Who loves and forgives us. Who loves and forgives us. In his name we pray. In his name we pray. Amen. Amen. Now, just a reminder to send your, your pictures or your videos of your crafts and the, the challenges uh, and, and the other activities. You can either send them to, to youth at mountolivefg.org or you can post them in the, the Facebook group uh, for the Mount Olive Church members. And so we hope you have a great time this week with all of the stories and activities, and we'll see you next week.